Hi, this is Chris Lawton with Intuit Health. I have the camera up in the tree. It's kind of funny. I wish I could turn it around to show you. So today I wanted to do a public service announcement and um, it has to do with, I do my readings on Wednesday night. They're free and usually a bunch of people come and the theme is using my medium skills to talk to their loved ones who have passed. So what I wanted to mention today is a theme that has happened over the years that I've seen. Um, and it's a really good reason for people to talk to someone like me to help get over um, the situation. So the situation that I'm talking about is if we have a loved one or someone that we know who has died violently, um, it seems to be in its human nature that when this happens, a lot of our memories are about what happened at the end, right? If you think about it, um, I talked to this person, they wanted to talk to their uncle, I believe it was, this was years ago, and he had been in a robbery and was shot. And um, when I looked at him, I actually felt like where he was shot, it was in the back of the head and it was a horrible situation. But his first thing that he wanted to tell his family was, please don't make me the family member who was shot in the head in a robbery. I'm not that person anymore and that doesn't define what my life was. It was just at the very, very end of how I left. And um, it's human nature. It's what we do because we put ourselves in the shoes of the people who have left us and if it was a horrific way of leaving, even if someone is very, very sick with cancer or some type of terminal illness and the discomfort that happens at the end of life, you tend to think about what they went through. Put yourself in their shoes and it's hard to remember them without those memories and visions popping into your memory. So one of the really cool things that happens when you get to communicate with the person that you're worried about is you get to have their perspective. You get to see what they went through. And sometimes what they went through isn't how you perceive what they went through. A lot of times um, they have help crossing over. So that person, it's almost like they get um, taken out of their body before the actual violence happens or they're a, almost like anesthetized a little bit so they're not really they're going through it but they're when they leave they don't that's not what they remember so um but i have very often um seen it's like escorts that come and help us leave right before the bad part ha happens so they the person may seem alert and aware and there but really they're not there sometimes even for the experience that you're mulling over and over in your memory about them. So this public service announcement is to tell you that if you would be happy to maybe come to Wednesday nights or if you want deeper work, give me a call and we can make an appointment and I have a three session group of appointments that work through the grief and the memory and at the end of all that there's a completely different perspective of what happened where they are how they're feeling um it's a very healing experience so that's just a little tidbit of part of the work that i do and part of the things that happen on wednesday night so just to let you know tomorrow night 8 p.m eastern standard time um, the link will be with this post and it's all over the place in my feed so you can easily find that and if you're listening to this on Instagram you can um, go to my bio and then just scroll down and all of the opportunities are there you can click on to sign up to come Wednesday night at 8 o'clock so we keep getting new people it's a lot of fun and you learn so much and um, I don't think anybody leaves disappointed so and there's a really great support system that's another thing you'll be with a bunch of other people who maybe are feeling the same way so you start to make friends and have people to talk to about your experience so I hope you enjoyed the video 
and I will see you maybe tomorrow night, if not, on our next video. Have a really great day. Bye.